we felt a lot of pressure because we had never swept OSU. Um, we have been looking forward to it all year. It's a big rivalry, as everyone knows. And the moment that we found out what happened before the game, it was just completely forgotten. We were we just got from the locker room. We were putting our shoes on when we had the news. I was sitting next to Sam, which you found out. Um, and my heart just hurt. You can feel it, it's right in your face, and it's like I would run for a walk my teammate when you're in a situation like that. And it really puts that saying of you play for your teammates in perspective, and we really do. It was really hard, I think, seeing one of my best friends and a teammate be affected like that before the game. It was really something that never happened to me before. And just something that I will always remember. To come together like we did. It was a moment, it was a surreal moment that we really had to come together and lift someone up that you love. I think everyone was spending a lot, especially this Brandon. She was very close to Brady and you knew how much he meant to her. The feeling of love and unity, the compassion and care was unlike any other felt in my life. Brother and team who kind of stepped up for their sister Sabrina. And, uh, and helped her. And I know almost to the person, he said, we're going to do this for you, we're going to do this for you, we're going to do this for you. Set.
You know what I learned that day? When you have people that shine the brightest and you need them the most, that's a powerful force. These people here, my teammates, never let my light get overshadowed by darkness. That is what the unfinished, unfinished business means. This team was my unfinished business. Today is not about personal achievement, it's about the people sitting next to you shining your light. It's time to